How to program an event on the 301C. Welcome to the HGAS YouTube channel. In today's video, we're going to learn how to program an event on the 301C controller. Access the programming menus by pressing the enter button and enter the standard password 2967. Once in the menus, scroll to menu 3, event, and press enter to select. Scroll to the action menu to target the output that is being used. Target indicates where is located the relay, TX transmitter, RE relay enunciator, CTRL controller. Output indicates which output will be activated when the event is true. XX activates the component's XX relay. Buzzer activates the component's audible alarm. All activates the relays and audible alarms. Scroll to the delay menu to define a length of time for the output to be active. Before delays the action for the specified length of time. If the condition persists beyond this delay, the defined action is executed. After, the time to wait after an event has returned to normal before returning action output to normal state. The after delay also offers a latch option. Scroll to the condition menu and enter the parameters that define what makes the event active. Define the transmitter or group of transmitters included on this condition. Define how many of these transmitters should meet the condition to trigger the event. Determine when the set points will meet the condition. Determine the set point to meet the condition on number 3. Scroll to the coverage period menu to determine the period during which the event is applicable. Day definition field allows all day, daytime, or nighttime to be selected. Week definition field, weekend, working days, all week. Scroll to the status menu to disable or enable the program event. After going through all the steps and programming an event, the screen will display Enable Event. Press Enter to activate all the parameters and enable the event. Example, if you want relay number 1 on the 301C to activate once it goes into alarm A for any sensors in the network at any time, the event programming will look like this. 